Hi, uh, welcome everyone. Uh, in this video, I will show you how you can uh, use drag and draw form builder of Discox multipurpose website and business management system CMS. So, let's go to the admin dashboard. Log into your dashboard after that, you will see the system and now go to the form builder and go to any, select any one of your form uh, we will select contact form so here, if you see here already have a one two three four five five fields here you can change the name and you can change their placeholder is it is this field is required or not you can change it from here so we are going to add a new field now and just close this to uh, we are going to add uh, just an example is text field now order this field however you want and then click this field and you need to enter field name I like text field. remember one thing you you cannot put a space in there like this you cannot use form name like this you have to maintain this one as like if you write uh, in any name you need to keep separate the word by like this and this is the one it will show in the content uh, like is it required or not we make it required and here is placeholder name like uh, test field let's update it okay then go to the main side now go to the contact list here it is our field is added same thing about the file if you have a new file system open here click there to open Sorry. Uh, click here to open the field. You have to put field name, placeholder, and is it required or not? You have to select uh, file type. And the uh, same thing about the checkbox. How you can you need to put uh, checkbox name and placeholder, and is it required or not? Also, same thing about select. Uh, you, you have to in the name test let me show you how you can use select box uh, so test select box let me remove this two we are not using it and here is the one test box is it required or not it's not required and here, here is the main thing how you can put the drop down for this select. So here, is, here I show you how you can put drop down for the select box. Uh, test, test, test. You have to put semicolon here to separate this line by line. And Now save and now go to front end and replace this space. And here you go. See, it's pretty simple. Thank you for watching this, this video. If you need any kind of help, you can uh, contact me from support or you can go at genius.com our official website so that you can get me you can contact, contact me from this website from contact page thank you so much for watching this video